Baker, and I'm Sophie. And this is Team Bacon and Egg with a soul on the side. We like to be creative. Yeah. Also, the name of our roller coaster is known as Death Man Draw. It's known to be this roller coaster because at first we start out from here, and even and you go through a small hill, and then at the end you go through a danger, a dangerous but safe tunnel with fireworks and pyro, and then you land safely in the spot where the the ride is over. And as you and demonstration, for said the week. As you see here, the roller coaster is safe. The people, the passengers, stay on the ride, and it's safe. Also, the ride is known to be worth worthwhile, and even though it will be kind of expensive, it'll be all worth it because there will be lots of visitors coming here. Because every time you go to the amusement park, do you see anything, anything with a, a small hill and then a small hill, but then a 70 feet foot. Drop down with pyro, fireworks, and all sorts of stuff. All sorts of crazy stuff. And ending up landing on this box. Well, the roller coaster is not built, the volume is not built to size. So it's not really 70 feet though. Alright, Edgar? Um, War Food Nation. I'm the physicist. I am Edgar. Team Bacon, Egg, and Cheese with a soda on the side decided to make the first feature of you because every roller coaster starts out with a tall hill. Well, the second reason is because um, the second feature is a smaller hill because it will be fun to go up and down the second hill. The third and last feature is a drop because the, the visitor would love to go down a 70 feet drop. The model, the model is not built to size. We know the visitors to sit guys will have fun riding our roller coaster called Dead Man's Drop because it's scary to go down a tall hill, but go down a tunnel 70 feet drop is just crazy to do to do something like that. Well, actually, if you were, a, if, I want to say, if I were a pas passenger and I and I want to ride this, because I would say it would be crazy and a totally great ride because. It's crazy to just go down a tall hill and just to go down a small hill, but to go down a 70 feet tunnel, that's crazy. I say, I say, oh, some people might say only crazy people would ride this ride, but it's a safe ride for everyone. And as you see with the marble representing the cart. Nobody <laughs> said that. Nobody, <laughs> Nobody saw that. <laughs> We did not have time to make the adjustments to build a bigger one, but if we do build a bigger roller coaster, it will definitely have to be an even size. Alright then. It has the most kinetic energy at the bottom of the first hill because it 
that is when all the potential energy has been converted to kinetic energy. And then the roller coaster is free to roam through the tracks. Alright. As the car goes down. As the car goes the, through the second feature, the kinetic energy changes to the potential energy and then right back to kinetic energy. As you see, it goes down, it changes from potential energy to kinetic energy. It goes down as soon as it's at the bottom point of the hill, it changes, it's at the highest point of kinetic energy. And then as it goes up, it changes back to potential energy very quickly. Because the roller coaster so fast goes so fast, you can barely see the transformation happen. All right. Also, some of the some of the energy from the roller coaster is lost because of friction, rubbing on the rubbing on the track, slowing it down, and also because some of the energy is converted to unuseful energy like thermal energy and sound energy. But most of the sound energy will be coming from the fans because. They're screaming down and also this ride will be made out of wood. Also, it, also when they actually build the roller coaster, there's going to be a prism, a sphere. And inside the sphere, there are going to be padded, there are going to be padded seats and the entire wall is going to be padded. And you're going to be told with seat belts from like that and like that to make sure that you don't hit, get hurt or anything. And also it'll be crazy because as the roller coaster is going down, you're going to be spinning along and rolling over. And also, warning, this ride may cause vomiting, burns, but uh, not so much. Vomiting, burns, uncontrollable, uncontrollable gas, and burning. Yeah, that's what's for any harmful events that you would have or any soulless burn for life. Well, emotionally, because it is your decision to ride the ride in the first place. It's not like we're forcing you to ride this ride. It's not like we're paying you. But you do get a big discount. That's what like, extreme. Most people would say that extremists who would like to live life and want to ride this ride. It's for anybody who wants to just have a good time. For me, I would say riding this roller coaster will be really scary at first because First you go up the big hill and then you're rolling out of control and then after the 70 foot drop you look out the window and then all all you see are fireworks and fireworks and fire. But also the spear is complete will completely protect you. So you won't get burned or hurt. But in case of any accident, you please don't sue the company. Please. Even though if you do get to serious injuries, and alright. And also like I said, we are not responsible for any scarring, emotional problems, and or just being scared. An example of Newton's first law of motion in our coral coaster is when the ball goes down to the hill and the balance force of gravity causes um, the ball to go down, the car to move because object is at rest, stays at rest when mass and balance forces acting on it. An example of Newton's second law of motion on our roller coaster is we need a certain force to get a certain distance because for, force equals mass times acceleration. An example of Newton's third law of motion on our roller coaster is gravity is pulling on our our head carts pulling it pulling it down and our car exerts or an equal force but because of the size and mass, the part doesn't feel any reaction. All right, this is the end of our presentation. Thank you. Thank you very much.